Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Elena's channel. This video is going to be about hyaluronic acid. This is the follow-up video from the first video that I've already posted. If you have not already seen, go ahead and check that video out called Hyaluronic Acid, my review. Um, I had ordered this from Wish.com and I have been faithfully using this every day. It's right here in the bathroom near the sink. So when I cleanse my face, I also use this and put this on as a moisturizer. If you guys want to see the difference, you guys interested in if this worked for me or not, keep in mind, remember the definition of hyaluronic acid, acid, the acid is to provide your skin with a smooth feeling. Um, it's actually supposed to act as a skin feeling and it's supposed to uh, decrease uh, lines and wrinkles that you have or scars or blemishes in your skin. Um, so I have definitely high uh, lines and wrinkles in my skin, especially on my forehead, we're frowning under eyes, and especially my small lines. So I wanted to basically decrease that um, and see if this hyaluronic acid would work for me. So not only did I buy one box, but I bought two boxes um, to see how long I would develop at least a transition or see a difference in my face. So stay tuned if you're interested in this video. If you like what you hear so far, go ahead and hit the like button, hit the bell and stay updated for further videos and follow-ups in regards to my last videos. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe. That way you can, um, instead of just seeing the second video, you can also see the follow-up video and know what I'm talking about if you ever see one of my videos and you're not a subscriber. So let's go ahead and get into the video. Hyaluronic acid. This is Essence B6. If you ever look and you order this box, on the back here, it tells you the ingredients. Water, glycerin, propylene glycol, methyl isothiazolinone. Um, you also have bis Listen, I'm not gonna read all these. I, I can't pronounce all these. Urea, butylene carbonate, disodium, EDTA, xanthan gum, sodium hyaluronate, vitamin H, folic acid, vitamin B12, 3, 6, 2, 1, yeast pepsides, and pantothenic acid. Um, yeah. You're supposed to massage this into your skin after cleansing your skin. And it's supposed to make your skin carefree, tender, moist, delicate, smooth, creamy, and you should have a beautiful skin vitality with a rich texture and a moderate finish. Um, me for one using this, I want to let you guys know, I'm going to open this box so you guys can see my progress so far. all over the place but this is the box inside try to make sure it don't fall out okay you see them all okay there's 10 10 in each side okay see that and there's two tubes for each row all right i have not used this box yet that's what i wanted to show you guys i have not used this box yet but as I told you, I ordered two boxes. So I'm still on my first box. Now, I want you to see how far along I am in, in my first box. Now it's my first box. You see this? Okay. Now, my last video was more than two to three weeks ago, okay? These little tubes here, these drops, no lie, these drops here, like, take forever. Like, I literally just started using all, all over my face and just used it as a, like, almost a moisturizer before I put on my makeup. Because if I'm just putting them on my wrinkles, these last a long time. <sighs> 
All right, so as I stated, you pull off the plastic on the top, and the silver part, you peel off, and then there's a rubber, rubber part, and you pop that off. And then you put, mm, and then you put this piece on here, squeeze it on, and then take off the top, and you apply it on your wrinkles. Here, here, I do here and here, and then I do my forehead. I moisturize it all over my face. And you see how small this little dropper is. So this, this lasts weeks, weeks, and I'm only on my third bottle, okay? Now, is there any different? Let's see. I right now have this whitening soap on my face. I got this from my local beauty supply store. Um, it's a whitening bar. Um, it gets rid of also blemishes and scars on your face. So um, I use it on my face because I have blemish marks still uh, all over my face. So I use it on my face. And if it keeps me lighter, that's another plus. <laughs> All right, and then I also use as a scrub, coffee. I use my coffee grinds, already used coffee grinds, okay? So I'm not really putting coffee beans on my face. It's already used and drained. Um, so I'm using the coffee grinds that is as a scrub. I already have it on my face, okay? These are not freckles. It's coffee grinds on my face. So I'm gonna rinse this off and I'm going to also do my mud masks for today with some cucumbers, you'll see that. I'm gonna rinse that off and I'm gonna apply this on my face. When I do, I mean, most of the time it dries and then it, it feels kind of like um, sticky or like, um, yeah, it just feels like sticky, like gooey, like it's tightening. And then you don't feel it anymore. And then it's gone. I don't know if you guys will see a difference, but I'm going to rinse my face so you guys can see um, me just cleansing my face and putting this on. And you can look and I'll put the um, link in the description box down below so you can view the other video. And I will take pictures and to see if you see a difference because I am in disbelief. I believe that I still have the same lines and wrinkles that I will always have because I guess I just smile too much and I'm just too happy. <laughs> Not. Nah. All right. So let's pause the video. Let's put on my mask, rinse this off and use that as a moisturizer.
lovely morning and it's already dried up within seconds um it just feels like mushy sticky but not in a bad manner and it just feels like it's already tightening so um i don't know if you guys see it different with the bleach soap that i used or the lightning lightning soap whatever you guys want to call it that i used to the coffee grinds to the charcoal and black sugar mask with my cucumbers but it did take some of my puffiness away that i had in my eyes and the moisturizer that i put on was the hyaluronic acid i'm gonna do my makeup and go about my day i hope you guys like my video i hope you guys see a difference from the last video um in regards to the wrinkles and lines in my face but as i stated with my smile lines they're just always going to be there so other than that thank you for watching this video and stay tuned to the next one bye